Hey guys, what's happening? Oh, we just dropped off all the mail at the post office and we got a gator call. Yeah. So we got to call Scott, tell him to meet us down here and follow us up to the gator call. Yep, let's do it. All right, let's you guys it. stick around, check out this video and hit that thumbs up right now because we can use it to help on our algorithm. And you guys are saints and we love you guys. Get swamped, share your passion and hit those thumbs up right now and we'll see you guys at the location. All right? Yep, let's get it. Hang tight, let's go. All right guys, we just got here to the Gator Call place. Z, you don't look so good. It's hot. It's hot. What's wrong? Car sick. <laughs> <laughs> whoop, whoop. All right, it is, we're back up to 100 degrees. We're going to get out, try to get this gator, get it caught up, and then get out of here. It's too hot to be messing around today. All right, we'll see you guys shortly. Ready, Z? Mm -hmm. All right, let's get out of here. Let's go try to get this gator. call box so what are we thinking call box let's see if we can get them down here where did they say they saw them at the other end? in this pond it's a big pond it's a big retention pond it's a really big pond and it goes over yeah I see that this is ridiculous Right there is the biggest pond in Sumter County. Yeah. In the village. This thing goes way back. It goes all the way back to the dog park back there. Oh my goodness. This is going to be a nightmare. Left pocket. I know. What are you... Give me my rod. Let's take a walk and see if we can find them first. Too, too much to down. too much to hold. If you want to bring the news, bring. It. I was just thinking that way it's easier. All right, bring the news. Less on your line. I was gonna walk barefoot, but that's concrete. That's gonna be. I don't have to bring the pole. I can just bring the news. You're gonna need the pole. You might as well just bring the pole and the news. I'm gonna get this to you. Put that on your keys. I don't have. I don't have my keys on me. Left them in the van. I got tape too, just in case. Hey buddy, no fishing or swimming. <laughs> Or boating. The concrete's hot on my feet. Why don't you walk in the grass? Because it's too long. Somebody should take care of the grass and cut it. <laughs> There's probably dog poop right around. The people don't pick up after their dog. Look, right there is the swamp to the biggest lake in Florida. Not in Florida, it's not as big as Okeechobee, but the villages. So pretty much you can leave this pond and go right over there. Yeah, that's Lake Sumter Landing. I was about to say, I... But I see a lot of brush rolled over. I was about to say, isn't like uh, Sumter or Lake Apopka bigger? 
Oh, yeah. But, B, that's that big lake we catch those big ones on. I know, but I'm, I'm just saying, like, you, you, the way that you said it, though. I know, I'm just frustrated. You want to keep those gators out of here? Put a dang chain link around there and put it down in the ground. Mm-hmm. Put a six foot high chain link. And look, you got a drainage pipe that goes right out there into the dang lake. Yep. Looks like it's an overflow box though. It is. So if it gets up too high? Yeah. But guess what that means? Gators can come over here. Yep. And when it gets high, they get out. Look, there that's all swamp, dude. Yeah. That's all swamp right there that goes into that huge lake. Wow. So what you're saying is this is gonna be the ultimate task. If this gator's still even in here, dude. True. Because he could just walk away. Exactly. He can go back and forth, back and forth. This might be a new hot call. Oh my goodness, dude. It seems like we're going to be here a lot. Mm -hmm. This is ridiculous. Because just the color of with that water alone is just telling me that we're going to be here a lot. And there's a dog park right there. Yep. Yep. I noticed that one when it came into the apartment of the complex. Yeah, we noticed it too. Yeah, we were talking about, look, a dog poop right on the sidewalk. Yep. Yummy. Walk their dogs here and don't even clean up after them. See, so that means it's safer to walk in the grass. <laughs> dog poop on the concrete. Dog, I've noticed several piles of dog poop in the grass. So it ain't safer. But this is ridiculous. I don't know what we're supposed to do here. It is a million degrees. Yes, it is. I'm melting as we're talking. We're going to put the call box up down there. Yep. And if one comes over, I'm scared one's going to come over from there. That's why I'm... Is being pushed down towards that's, that direction? That's water. Yeah, when we had the high waters a couple weeks ago, all those rains. That's what I was going to say. It, I don't like... Watch out for the landmine. I know. <laughs> Me. Mm. Smell that. No. Well, Tell me if they look at the dog. it. Is that dog poop? Yes. <laughs> Is it dog or cat? Come Scott, on. taste. Tell me. No, no, no. I want B to tell us. You ask him first. I refuse to answer, so it goes on to you. Oh, so you're pleading the fifth on it? Yep. All right, there's only one way to do this. Put the call box down there at the end. Uh-huh. Give it a half hour. If it comes, it comes. If not, I'm calling it in. I'm saying, I don't know what you want me to do. They got an Lake open... landing is right there. Yep. And no and fence. literally, there's spots here that are... 20 feet from the water. Yeah. Mm -hmm. no, no, back there it was only like... No, it's actually right up here. Right yeah. here. Yeah, five feet almost. Just the grass area. Well, the grass there. area, that's more than 20 feet. I don't know. Yeah, like I know it's right cool there. right here in the shade. I know, I'd love to sit right here, but I don't want to put the call box here because it's too close to the swamp. Yeah. Yeah, we'll have them creeping up behind us. 
I don't want to call gators over here just to catch them for the sake of catching them. Yeah, that's water right there, dude. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's Iron about 15 eight. feet. Not even. Well, yeah. Well, lay your lay your pole down. Probably about eight to ten foot. It's over. About ten foot. Eight foot. Yeah, about ten foot. So yeah, ten feet away, the water. Yep. They just need to. If they want to stop it. They got like you said. Got to put up a fence and embed it in the ground. That's the only way to stop this. Look, it's there, it's 20 feet away. Yep. <sighs> Fun filled day. Now see, stuff like this is such a waste of gas and time. We could be doing stuff at the farm. Taking care of all our stuff. Scott, we're going to put it down here in the corner here to see. Because mm -hmm. I ain't sitting in the sun. Plus, that way they face towards the wall. Yeah. And not really. If we do it over there, it's going to still be directed at the swamp area. Yeah. And we'll put it down by the water. Yep. That way. Down way, stay low. Okay, we're coming back to this spot. Yeah. Exactly what I was thinking too. Yeah, just guard yeah, it basically. Just bring up, bring, give Scott my keys. You need my keys? Z, you can go get your uh, bar to get your eat your candy and shut off the truck. All right, they're on their way up there to get the stuff from the truck. We'll set the call box down there close to the water so the sound doesn't carry over here into that swamp, which you can see right there that goes into the biggest lake in the villages. Of course, there's gonna be gators. That's the biggest lake. There's hundreds of gators in there. Oh my goodness. Well, that's the way the bacon fries. All right, I'll wait till they get back and we'll start filming. I'm gonna watch for a gator, see if we see one. All right, we got the call box out. See what happens. Dude, my sweat is sweating again. It is so hot. That's all we can do. Just kind of always have to walk behind us, too. I'm just hoping the sound doesn't help. It is. It is, but. With how the building was made? Yeah. It's big. No, I'm saying because they put balconies on every floor, it's causing a um, well, cup effect. It's not even the balconies; it's the whole structure there. Yeah, that's I know they bounce it yeah, back. Yeah, they're, they're making, but they made it into a cup effect, though. So it's yeah. going to be. So it's a sound wall, basically. Yes. So it's basically echoing it back further this way. just algae side in there that's not going to kill bacteria yeah it's just going to kill algae yeah you can't be too good on the eyes no about to have a thunderstorm too i hope it thunderstorms i'll stand out here in the rain at least i'm not going to get flesh eating diseases in the rain yeah unless that's
Don't open your mouth and talk in that direction. <laughs> Thirty minutes or so, forty minutes. That is cool. You know, God invented such beautiful things, like the rainbow. That's beautiful. Look at it. Oh, oh, there. It's there. Disappearing. All right, let me get this call. Okay, see, that was Sal. So, Sal is the property manager. And he said they're seeing them on this end. He realizes that it goes back and forth, but they've seen them several times, so it's probably the same gator going back and forth. And I just explained to them, people, I really don't want to put a bait line out here because people walk their dogs down here. We got a smelly chunk of meat on there. I don't want their dog going after and getting a hook, a hook in his I mouth. Their dog the leash. Yeah. And people do it. And he said, well, they're not supposed to. But when we pulled in, that dog was running without a leash. Exactly. I mean, it happens. People do it. They come down here, they let their dog off the leash, and they gave it like that in there. The dog goes down to drink some water, and wham! Or goes sniffing into the bushes. And wham. And, and wham look, again. look what I just saw, Z. This looks like a trail right there into the swamp. Mm -hmm. You know, whether it be raccoons or what, that, that gator is probably walking up right through that trail. Because that's a swamp about 40 feet right there. Yeah. So, I told him, we'll sit here for about 30 minutes and see what happens. All I see is a turtle head. That's all I see, too. <laughs> And we'll give it 30 minutes. We'll sit around. Okay. And then... I'll do a couple of walks with the camera then. All right. You're going to walk down that way and check? Yep. All right. Watch the hook there, buddy. I don't want to... I saw... Cast down. Cast down. I'll be right over his shoulder. Why is he coming? See. Anything good, anything good. Yeah, no, this is a pretty ridiculous one. Now we got choppy waters. Working. 
which makes it so much harder. But yeah, honestly, it's this is a this is a pain one. I think I just heard somebody talking about us, but yeah, never know. Yeah, we're we're just trying. Yeah, I was watching the other one. I guess seven foot. Okay. <laughs> No. Let's see. All right. This gentleman just came up to us and told us he was just down here around the corner. We'll see if he's down there. still be able to hear that call box. Down around that corner. I saw a turtle right there. Yeah. How you doing? Driving down, poor Scott nuts down there now. I can still hear the call. Perfect. Again, because the echo. Yeah, it's bouncing off that. Yeah. I think we might have passed where he said it. I'm not really sure. All right, Jim. I can see why people like to do this walking. Oh yeah, it's beautiful walking out here. Careful the dog poop. What? Careful the dog poop. I know, I saw it. Yeah, 
I came this far and then just turned back. Should we do it? Uh, hook, test hook. Should we do a test hook? No, I'm not going to. Plus, I, I don't like the look of the, how that fountain's kind of done. Okay. I've been looking. Yeah. I see you over here. I don't see you anymore. Like, right yeah, I'm looking. Like, I think he ain't gonna do nothing. Funny, our call box sounds like it's over there. I know. And it's actually on this side, bouncing off that wall. Yeah. In the building. So right there, you can see how close the water is. Yeah. I don't know if that's just a natural look or the rain rise. No, that's the swamp where it comes over. I don't want to see the rain rise then. Now I can hear the call box here and from over there. Yeah. You can hear it from both directions. Mm hmm All right, G. I think we're going to shut it down. Yeah. I left Sal my phone number. I said, I'll tell you what. He doesn't want us putting bait out there because people walk their dogs. I said, you call me when you see him, and we'll head straight over here. So this is definitely another one that will be continued. The chase after the terrorizing gator in, gator in the apartment complex. Gator, gator. <laughs> All right, let's pack up our stuff and get out of here. Yep, let's go. All right, just as we packed up and get ready to leave, the guy walking the track here, said, you guys looking for the gator? I said, yeah, there's a 
was only like a six footer right here and a, a bigger one that kids were telling us. And he said he's down here, he's on that side by the wall. You can see him when you're up there. You can look down. You can see him. Here, he's just pointed. Good. He's right over by that white pole. Scott, walk up there and look down. Yep. It's our farm. To our farm. What? Our farm. Well, he's down under there. If he's got a name, it's Sam. I don't know if he comes here or not. He comes to me. No.
Yeah, walk down this way a little bit and look. All right. Yeah, just trying to get rid of that sun glare. Oh, Dad. What? I think he was just right there. Yeah. Where? Where like the right in front of right me. Right on the tip of that grass line, water just wake. Right in front of me he was. Right there. Yeah. See the point of that grass? Out there? Yeah, water waked out there. My downside is all that grass. There he is. Oh, that was him, huh? Yep. He's about five, six. Yeah. Enough to be dangerous too. He dropped straight down. I don't know where he went to from there though. I think he just said no. It got dark real quick. Oh, right there. Where? Where is he? Uh, the fountain, I thought. He's going by the fountain? I, I can't see anymore because of the sun glare. Very sketchy. Where? Bring the call box down here. There he is. Yep, go ahead. Scott, don't move. I'm staying up here. Oh, that's big. His head's facing towards the shore. Uh, all right, go start the call box out there. Right where it's at? Yeah. That's bigger than six foot, dude. Yeah, that's what I just said. I said that's way bigger. Seven, yeah. So he's right there. Yeah, about there. He knows how to be scared at least. Really? Yeah. Right here? Yeah. She, she always comes right here. That would explain why. I'm not sure how loud you want to hold it. We don't want it too loud because that's going to. It's about eight feet. times already. Yeah. It's already done twice. So that woman's feeding him? That's so dangerous. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, he expects food. These people don't understand. They feed them and they lose their fear of humans and then that's when accidents happen. time do you usually see her feeding them? I don't think he likes it. I don't think he likes it. He hasn't heard it yet. Which woman was it, the one talking to us? White woman, blonde hair, blonde hair, older, huh? Uh, she was just up there in the very top building. Right there, over there. Okay. She said his name is Sam. 